All right, this is Yara here, and I'm over here with Zachy, who got first place at our locals in Game Master in Rolette, Texas. And what deck are you playing, Zachy? Sun Avalon. Yes. Sun Avalon, okay. He actually topped at a regional with this deck as well. So uh, before we get started, do you have any shout outs or anything you want to say? I'll shout out everyone at GM for, you know, loading me cards, especially for the regional. I like, I had so many blowout cards, I couldn't do it without them. Um, I think that's it. Okay. So just, I'll keep it short. Uh, for the cards, we have the starters. This is basically the, you know, top what, second place UK list. Okay. Um, it's extremely similar. The hand traps are different, but other than that, there's like not much. Draw, draw, draw. These are just the starters. Uh, the Brave Package, I believe it's 10 cards, uh, and then we got the Furon Package, not these. Uh, these just help you play through boards and set up your negates. Uh, the Punk Package, it's Z Admin, Foxy Tune, and Deer Note, the 3 Telly. You always side these out uh, when going second and just put in all your board breakers. So you get your one card combo and like four other board breakers. Um, then your one ofs, your granites, the ones you don't want to draw. Um, and you also take you take this one out when you're going second because it's part of the punk combo only. And then uh, in the UK nationals, the guy who got second place with the deck, he was saying that the brave and in any tuner hand trap is full combo. Um, if you check his list, he like shows the combo for it, and that just gives the deck like so much more consistency than it you know previously had. I can't imagine playing without it. Yes. Uh, we have some more one ofs Droplet is only a one of because this is vocals. I don't have any more. Um, just being broke. Uh, two triple T. Uh, I got rid of one for a drop. So another reason why these are weird ratios. Uh, the sewing. It's your main combo starter. Um, three cross out. The gamma package. One nib for cross out and a small war bridge. Two baler for cross out and being a hand trap. Two droll. Three ash. Um, this is at three because, like, I don't want nib at three. I don't want to damage my own board. Droll doesn't hit every deck. Ash does. Uh, and then one in perm as a cross out target. You get to play a lot of hand traps in that deck, right? Yeah, it's a, this is 60. So you can just fit as much as you want in that. Um, this is just, it's basically the UK Nats list, except with Cross Out. Uh, two of each of these. I think the extra deck is like exactly the same. So we got two Melius. Everything besides the generic links are all combo pieces. This is just if you, uh, what is it? If you brick or like your opponent hand trap suit, you can go into this and you can mill like something like Brave. They weren't playing this in the UK NAS list. They were playing Thrasher, which is like used for OTKs. But with like how many big beat sticks you have and how much board removal, you don't really need Thrasher in here. This just helps you get to your Brave combo if you don't get it at the start of your combo. Um, the unicorn is with the brave and one hand trap combo. Your boss monsters, this gets you the trap card, this gets you the um, this gets you a bounce and interruption and it's good recursion. Um, this card it actually came up a lot in my wins where I would make this and have enough to put something like a third Melius under it to pop three cards your opponent controls. A lot of people don't know about that effect. Um, and then part of the Brave Tuner combo, Stardust, and then Baron for the Z Admin combo, uh, and then just Token. So it's just pretty generic. Um, now for the extra or side deck, one Harpies, two Nib, uh, Harpies because Spell and Trap deck suck, uh, two Nib because we got the other one in there. I knew I was missing a 
Three rogue deck. Thank you for that. Okay. Three evenly, Thank three you. dark ruler, and three twin. Wow. We're it's not playing any going first cards because this deck can already make really, really such a great board going really first. It doesn't need it. No, yeah. All it struggles with is playing control like board. Right. So we have our you know spell and trap removal. Right now. And then all of these are just for the big combo decks. If they try and you know. All the board stuff, or all of the turn ending combos like Scythe or Abyss, can, uh, they lose to the Dark Ruler. They'll lose to the Regeki. They'll lose to Nib. And so that's why we have so many different, like, board cards to bring the board. Yeah. Um, and then. Yeah, there's not travel. That's it. Yeah, people used to know you as the prank it master uh, before they got banned out, and now you're playing this. This is very similar to prank it, right? Because it's like a one card combo. Just a one card combo. Right. Uh, do you say this is better than what prank it was back then? Sadly, I think so, yeah. Okay. Just because of, you know, one card prank it board could make up like two regekis. Well, this makes up like, you know, six interruptions, seven interruptions off of one card. I just think it's just the advanced version of Frankens 2. Oh, Frankens 2.0, right? Mm -hmm. Alright. Thank you so much, Saki, for that awesome deck, bro. I appreciate it. Thanks.